Good morning guys and happy 2022. Uh I barely slept last night, but I'm awake and uh I'm gonna I just finished my treatment. I'm going to take my meds and eat something. I'm not hungry, so I'll probably just have like a bowl of cereal or something, I'll figure it out. And then I need to work on the saddest part of January first, which is taking down all the Christmas stuff. And I can get I can I can get most of it down. I can't do the tree. Um, I'm gonna see if I can do the tree in our room because it's a little lighter. But I can't do that tree for sure. And I can't get the tins down that are on top of the kitchen cupboard. But everything else I can start taking down. I'm gonna start with the stuff on the porch. It's just always so much more depressing than putting it up. You know, it's like when you're putting it up, you're having all this holly jolly Christmas music and Christmas spirit and it's around Thanksgiving time and everybody's just happy and in the holiday spirit. And then January 1st, it's like, Bang! all right, take it all down. So yeah, if I wait till this evening and I have another chance to turn on the lights, it, that's not gonna end well for me. So I'm gonna take it all down before I have another chance to turn on the lights. And then this evening, I'm going to watch the, uh, the Harry Potter special around the time I normally would turn on the lights and that'll get me through the first night without the Christmas stuff. <laughs> that sounds dramatic, but I do get sad. I get sad every single year when it comes down, but the good news is I get over it in about three days. So anyway, that's what I'm gonna do, but happy new year guys. Finally, we left it behind. We do not speak its name. It is the year that shall not be named. And uh, yeah, it's a, Good morning to wake up to a fresh, shiny new year. Well, it's time to get started, sadly. You guys know what is amazing though? My tape held up for a month and a half. I didn't have to fix this tape once this Christmas season. Uh, usually I do have to like fix it once or twice. Those chairs are in my way, I'm gonna have to move them. I'm gonna take down the uh, ribbon and I'm gonna get the lights. But uh, yeah. It held up all year, so that's wonderful. One gross thing, though, that I know is going to happen. Uh, because this has been here since, what was it? Was it before Thanksgiving? I don't even remember when I put this up. It was sometime around Thanksgiving. So it's been up like a month and a half. Uh, there's always like this clean white line where the tape has been because uh, the dirt's been accumulating everywhere else. But then it gets catches up eventually, so... Bye, ribbons. I can't think too much about this or I'm going to get sad. And I don't want to be sad on New Year's Day. So I'm going to listen to music, not Christmas music, and uh, get to work. Also, P.S. Florida, it's January. Don't feel like summer. Come on now. Feels like it's almost 90 degrees. Oh boy, that went from sad to frustrating very quickly. Uh, I know why my tape never came down because it was a mess to get off. I, uh, um, I think I just spent 30 or 40 minutes just taking the balcony decorations down. Just that. But it's done. And it didn't help that I was sweating because it's like so hot outside. But the rest of it can be done in air conditioning. The rest of it should be easier to get down. And I think I'm not quite as sad after fighting with the balcony for 40 minutes. So, plus side. Anyway, let's, uh, keep going. And I'm gonna label everything because we don't remember labeling everything last year but apparently we did it made it so much easier to put it up so gonna label everything the other big challenge is gonna be those and that because i had to lean to get those on the wall but we're gonna take down some stuff in the living room that's easier give myself a break and then we'll tackle this and also get all the ornaments and lights and tree skirt from this tree and see if I can take it down. I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to be able to. If I can't, just get everything off. But we're going to do some easy stuff first. Unfortunately, this is not salvageable. The, the uh, snowflakes are. I got them all off. But the words started ripping or the colors started coming off the words when I was taking it off. So I guess it'll be a yearly December tradition to do another one. Even though it took me like 
three hours, but oh well. Labels, they make everything better. I feel like I've gotten a lot done. Balcony, kitchen entryway. That's all the bedroom. Um, I I took off the um, all the ornaments, tree skirt, and the lights off the tree in there. And uh, this has been an interesting takedown of Christmas stuff. Um, somehow the lights ended up knotted to the tree. I don't know how that happens or what the heck we did when we put it up, but they were knotted to the tree. So yeah, that was interesting getting them off. And then I had to like lean the tree over to get the star off, but I got all that done. And I'm gonna do all the stuff out here that's easier that I can do. Like I said, this one will not be done until tonight because I need help with that. But most of everything else I can get accomplished. And then tonight also I get to put up my paintings and stuff. So, cause the walls look very bare in there right now. That's the thing. Like when, not only do I miss the lights, but it's just like when all the stuff comes down, it looks so empty in the house for a couple days, but then you get used to it. Okay, well, if there's one thing I'm learning about me, it's that I'm terrible at putting pictures up straight. So during Christmas time, we have different pictures that go on the wall versus the rest of the year. And uh, I've just spent like, I don't know, 15 minutes trying to get these two pictures straight, that picture straight. And then when I tried to put this up, I had to take the nail out of the wall and put it back in because it was sliding out. It was uh, interesting. But... There is one nice thing about, as sad as it is, like when the house gets empty, it is nice to see all of your year-round, like yearly decorations that you haven't seen since November. Um, so, we're making progress. And I can have a reward for all that hard work. Every year, once a year, we get a sparkling grape juice to bring in the new year, and I love it. I'm not a huge fan of regular grape juice, but for some reason I just love sparkling white grape juice. And we bought two. We only used one last night. It looks like wine. It's not, I promise. I'm not alcoholic. <laughs> we only used one last night uh, when we rang in 2022. So there's a whole other bottle in here. And drinking some of that's my reward for taking everything down because my back hurts and that was a lot of work. <laughs> well, that is my limit officially reached. Uh, the only thing we have left is the two trees. This tree still looks happy and, you know, Christmassy. This tree, it's quite sad to look at. But uh, yeah, literally that's all that's left besides some tins way up at the top of the cabinet that there's no way in heck I'm gonna be able to reach because even my dad has to use a stool to reach those. So those and the trees, that's it. And that should take, with help, that should take only maybe another 45 minutes to get down tonight. Um, I also took away the tree skirt. I mean, it was already messed up anyway, so. I'm debating on if I want to turn on the tree tonight, because there's about a three hour time difference between when he gets home and when darkness falls, or if I want to not torture myself like that and just call tomorrow night the last night. I'm not sure yet. I know I probably won't turn on the one in the room because it just looks sad, but um, yeah. Taking stuff down is always uh, a lot less fun than putting it up. And a lot more work, it feels like. It just feels like, I guess, because you're so excited to put everything up, um, it doesn't feel like as much work, but taking it down just feels like work. But it's been about two hours and I got everything down by the trees and finally got things up on the wall, you know. Um, straightening pictures is not my forte, but I did it. And, uh, the only other thing to do, like I said, is take those down and then put my puzzle board back and then I can put um, this by the puzzle board so that when I get back in, from Arkansas in late January, I can try to piece that together. <laughs> so that's going to be a wrap on today because I'm exhausted and uh, I'm going to rest for a little bit and then I'll upload this and then I'm not sure, probably eat something. Uh, play game and try not to get sad about the empty house um, because it's 2022 it's a new year and that feels crazy I'm still thinking it's like 2021 but it's not it's 2022 it's New Year's Day 
it's a new chapter. So let's hope for a good chapter. So with that, thank you guys so much for coming along on my day today, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.